Bless the love and greetings from the image and hear the voice in our assignment working is and eyes. You know and I mean, shout out to all the friends, families, and fans, all the viewers, you know and I mean, subscribers. If you haven't done so, please do so by subscribing and clicking the bell. You may have done, I hope all is well. See? Um, yeah, man, from what you know, past few days I haven't been up and active with you know, because I've been busy officiating, you know what I mean, um, refereeing. Yesterday I had a long journey to the countryside, you know. High intense game, came home tired, oversleep. So, right now, almost three o'clock. Um, on the road, I'm going to get some food for go cook. You see me? Because Steve, if you fly out of the kitchen, you know what I mean? Feel me some color look today, you see me? Yeah, man, but anyway, when I wake up today, you know, I say, um, hold up a notification for my phone. Say, um, curvy diva, this spice, you know? Um, Curvy diva style spice, Yannick. You see me? So I say, oh, I go on, you know. You know what I mean? Um, go on to on stage and watch, watch the full interview. And for me, nothing was like that, you know? It wasn't like that. I mean, Colin did a great interview, she spoke well. Just watch a quick preview of the questions she was asked and how she answered them. All right, so, so let's get straight into the hypocrisy of all of this. Which is what uh, you know, Spice is 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 talking about in her in her song. My my only problem with that, Winford, is mm -hmm. you shouldn't do anything because somebody says. I I I totally wrong Spice for that to say she's doing it because they say she's too black or she looks dirty black or whatever. You should do it because this is your expression of how you feel. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna wear my hair short because Winford doesn't like it. Well, she was just provoking a conversation. And, Still doesn't and, matter. And you should change it. It's an important it. conversation. You should not worry what other people think of you. Mm -hmm. You should worry what you think of yourself. Because, as I said, when for doors have been closed in my face, I've been turned back, and it's a big ridicule on the media circuit that then to say I was turned away from a club. Yes. I, there are disadvantages and advantages. As I probably paved the way, I remember. And either side of the argument. A lot of girls. Black women have advantages? In dance, all they do. A oh. lot of. Because it, it, it's, a, it's a feel that they thought that's who belongs there. Mm. So if you look certain way, spoke certain way, behave certain way, you did not belong to dance all. Look back on the history, though. Look back on your history, how many brown girls were there. You think they didn't try? Come on, I'm not the only brown girl in Jamaica. You think they didn't try? But now I've opened that door so all the brown girls are coming. Come on, you think they just all came? Well, I, I can I can I, I can appreciate what you're saying because they, there's they, a the, they, the, the, the standard could be higher. It was not accepted for the brown girls. But we see think. those in our artists who are struggling too. Exactly. The, the light skinned girls. Exactly because struggling a, as artists. And a lot. Because they probably have to do it another way. Mm -hmm. and try to use their appearance, which is wrong. She's just, a brown girl is just as talented DJ-wise a dark girl. They find themselves insecure about find their, security. or feel, or feel that they are being left behind, they're disadvantaged as a result of their complexion, you say, you say to them? I say, find who you are. Look at your niche, look at what you're here for, and work at it. Hard work does prevail. Yeah, man, so this is a Colleen spoke her mind, she spoke well, she said it wasn't easy for her, you know what I mean, as a, as a brown girl, eye color girl, girl coming in the business. And I really think cause it wasn't easy for them, because they must say if you're uptown, who is, who is you for coming to the dance hall? And I said, stay from the end of the years. But things on time change now. Because the change is a breakthrough, all if a brown color a breakthrough. Sean Paul, it wasn't easy for him either, you know what I mean? He was highly criticized, so I, so I threw him color while he reached certain stages, you know what I mean? Yeah, so well done to Carlene. She speak it out, speak her mind and talk it as it is. She wasn't this in Spice because she says Spice beautiful, you know. But she shouldn't make nobody make she go to that route. And I say, your people make you do this and people make you do that. If you follow people, you kill yourself, you know. If you follow people, you don't believe and you doubt yourself and don't try to elevate. And the mouth alone can hold you down, you see me? Yeah, man, so big up Spice as well. You don't know my artist. See? Yeah, man. Um, Next one, Curvy Diva, she was asked a question. You know what I mean? And I didn't think she spiced ice. I don't think she did spice. Watch the video. If you're a pretty girl, mm -hmm. as you are, you, the black will be added to it. Yeah, well, like spice. 
Oh, Spice is a beautiful person. And I love what she did the other day. I mean, with the whole black hypocrisy, I get where she's coming from. And as I said, boy, I am that person. I am testament to that where I would have a brown friend and a guy would come up and, you know, kind of quick to look my brown friend. And I'm like, but we cuter still, you know, like, you know, but brown skin, it does get ahead. I guess it's, it's the whole thing in your mind where you think brown is, is prettier, brown is nicer. It's, you know what I mean? I don't know. Guys, guys do that. Friends do that, girls do that, everybody do that, and I'm, I'm tired of it. I just, I believe that Spice, she made a solid point, and she just, you know, should continue to embrace that. How personal do you think it is for her? I think it's very, it's very personal. personal. Yeah, man, because at the end of the day, sometimes they don't even need to go in on Spice like that. Half of the time, they say, oh, Spice, she look, she too black, she too this, you should eat for bait. And she's, she's improving. Spice, she polished me, she look good. I see the improvement, I see where the hairstyles change, the body look better, all of these things, but nobody's seeing that because Lord, I can't but I look one spice, no, it's not she too black. And I'm like, but what, she's gorgeous, yeah. her complexion is gorgeous, and yet still, she have to feel that and, and get that, and no matter how she put in the work, and continue to put in the work, people still are judge on her skin, come on, really? Yeah, man, so she said, she said, um, people are bash spice, she also spray spice for the movement, you know what I mean, and people are bashed spice for more long and I saw people steal and she says spice has improved which on a styling thing that spice has improved me know spice when from she's slim I mean unless I come into the game she improved her music get better you know and I mean performance get stronger and stronger which is why she's been dubbed as the queen see so she improved what spice herself so she do loop production you know what I mean belly talk about one name you know what I mean and she's sexy and she changed, you know what I mean? So that is what Curvy D was saying. You know what I mean? She don't mean like Excess Spice, you know? So that's, and that's that with um, us people you know, some of the vloggers, them, them. So the wrong thing and they start with the beef. And the fans, them bring the wrong information across and artists, them take it and start this before they watch it. And put two and two together and say, no man, she don't mean nothing, man. You see me? But what, what Curvy Diva said is facts. Spice has improved and changed. You know, hairstyle, everything. Right now, Spice hot and sexy and look good. See? So that's what Curvy Diva was just saying. See? Yeah, man. Please like, comment, subscribe. I don't know why I'm working the truth and right. See me? You see me? Nesbeth, big up yourself. The album there, you see me? First album is just time, you see me? As what you say, if you build up the fan base and do the work and the fan base will come. You see me? Then, um, yeah, man, so big up yourself. Big up everyone, just live good money, you see me? Yeah, man, I'm going to raise the next topic now with, 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 with um, Shelly Belly and Ding Dong. Shelly Belly are called Ding Dong, Jing Bang, you see me? But I'm going to do that in the next clip, because right now we're up on the road, I'm going to look some food, go buy some color look, you see me? Yeah, man. So big up on yourself and peace and love. Live good, live clean, keep it real. And man of peace, what's up, Mark? Yeah, man. Check out my single dear lad, and please support. Yeah, man. Step on all the platforms, I'm saying. Blessed love.